All right, hello everybody. Um, I'm here about an hour before POF releases, and uh, just kind of wanted to walk through my account, do another account tour, um, just to kind of give myself a state of where I was before POF released. Um, I'm gonna do this one a little bit differently. We have some new tools now. Um, we'll jump. So, with that, I'm gonna jump straight to uh, GW2 efficiency. And as you can see, uh, look at this is my character list. I have one of every class except for. Uh, Ellie, I kind of created a second Ellie because I didn't like the Sora too much. Um, and you can see most of my playtime was between my Guardian and my Necro. Those are my two big ones. I do. I uh, starting to play Warrior a little bit, and that's because of raids. I'll probably end up doing World Completion on the Warrior. Um, Kasai and Carla, the first two up there that you could kind of see are both World Completed. Um, then Mesmer and the Warrior will probably be the next ones to be world completed just so I can get some additional uh, items to create some legendaries later on. Kind of see, I have uh, all the crafts done. Um, chef's done on a few of them, Jeweler's done on a few of them. Um, and um, you can kind of see the hours I played right here. We're at. Uh, 4,600, right over 4,600 uh, on Kosai. Um, if you look back at my old video, um, I was at 3,175 on Kosai. So I put in another 1,500 hours since uh, Hot released. And the last thing I kind of want to talk about while we're in here um, is the account value. So let me grab that really quick. As you can see right here, my account value is at a little over 65,000 gold. Um, most of that is in uh, my wardrobe, and dyes, things like that. That's not like what you can see um, when it comes to things that are in my bank that I can actually sell right now. My God, that's about 3,800 gold. Um, let's uh, jump back into the game. And that way I can uh, go back over uh, everything else that I want to discuss for today. Uh, so next up on the list is I kind of wanted to go over my legendary items. Um, before the release of Hot, I had one legendary. I had Twilight. The uh, items that I have gotten since then are... Um, let me swap weapons real quick. The legendary shield. Um... The legendary back piece from Fractals. Uh, this was actually one of the first things I got, but even before I ended up getting a shield. Um, and then Nevermore. Uh, Nevermore was made almost purely for World v. World. Um, the other items that I have are all going to be armor items. I've gotten four of the six pieces from uh, the raid. Uh, probably would have had five. If I, Li wouldn't have hurt me on caps, haven't been able to raid as much as I have liked recently, so that has uh, hurt me a little bit. Um, should actually get the next piece, which I'm probably going to do the boots next. Uh, the first week of hot, actually, if we can, if I can get into some raids. I think that's kind of all I wanted to say on uh, the legendary. Right, let's move on to uh, the next thing, uh, which would be my achievement panel. Let's jump into the achievements panel before Hot, uh, which I want to say that video was made about a week before Hot. I had 17,000, just under 17,700 achievement points. I'm now over 23,000. Um, My magic find right now is at 240% account wide. Uh, before hot, it was 197. So I've actually been slowly but surely bringing that up again. I have not bought any uh, weapons or anything to do that. I've just been uh, leveling that up naturally as I uh, salvage things throughout the game. If I go through these achievements, one of the Big things you'll see is that I can probably do a little bit better on the PvP World v. World stats. 
Uh, I need to get in there some more. If I really want to get some achievement points done, I can get a lot more done if I could get into Warp the World and PvP a lot more. Um, but with raids and everything else that they've introduced, I've really been pulled into PvE this year. And you can kind of see that if I look at my Worldly World rank. Before HOT, I was at 1075. Um, right now, I'm only at 1265. If I'd have kept on the path that I was before HOT, you would have seen this go up a lot. Um, hmm. Back from that tangent, let's get back into this a little bit. One of the things that... Uh, I really, really worked hard for before HOT that I was kind of disappointed I wasn't able to get done. I was doing it through PvP actually at the time, uh, was the dungeon collections. Uh, so basically the dungeon collections are to get all the skins for all the dungeons. Uh, and as you see now, I do have the Dungeoneer title. Uh, that was something that I worked on it took me, I want to say I got that done about three months after HOT. Like I said, I was hoping I would get it done before HOT. I wasn't able to. Came back and uh, finished it. I talked about my characters and how old my characters were. Speci specifically Kosai, because he gets most of my play. Um, if you're looking at across all my characters, uh, before hot i was at 4056 hours across all characters right now across all characters i'm at 5740 um, so a little bit more play time across my uh, all my characters of course because of raids i've been kind of pulled away from dragon hunter um so you can see i'm I, it's about 1700 additional hours compared to the 1500 it was just on kosai Uh, and this one's going to be a lot shorter than my last video. I kind of rambled on on the last video. Uh, I really didn't want to make this that long. I wanted this to be something that was just for me. So I wanted to run through this real quick. Give myself a s kind of a state of where I was on everything. Um, if you guys have any questions, like I said earlier, uh, you can hit me up on Twitter. You can hit me up on YouTube. Um, all of my accounts have all of my accounts are available on the YouTube channel and the links. I also have a site which has access to all of my uh, social media links. So you can go there. 